In terms of uh, leveraging the politicians, are there any lobbying groups that you'd recommend that we join in terms of professional organizations or anything like that? Because I don't see the numbers or the voices yelling your message. And it's going to take the voice of the masses to do that. <laughs> well, I'll tell you what, you know, you're, you're absolutely right. And, and all I can say is at Nucor, the entire team's doing everything we can to get that message out there. Our CEO and Chairman Dan D'Amico does an absolutely outstanding job of making sure that every opportunity he has, he gets that message out there. And I, and I do see some signs that people are starting to get the message. If you look over the last two months, the Wall Street Journal has had a few articles about the importance of job creation and the manufacturing sector to the success of the economy in the United States. You never saw that a year ago. We didn't see that six months ago. The New York Times, the Washington Post have been doing the same. Nucor runs ads. We just ran one in the Wall Street Journal last month, specifically addressing this issue. In terms of specific organizations, there's many, many out there. You have the uh, AISI, American Iron and Steel Institute. You have the World Steel Organization. You have the, um, uh, there's several out there. Uh, and, and, and frankly, you don't need to be part of a big organization to have an impact on change. I, I, I want to I stress this because if you, with your teams, okay, get to the local politicians, you, you it's hard to express just how much power you have. We all need to remember, and I, I believe the mayor has left the room and I'm, I hope he has, okay? okay? But there's only one, the number one priority of every politician, the minute they get elected, or let me rephrase that, the number one priority of most politicians, probably the vast majority of politicians, okay? Their number one priority as soon as they are elected is to do what? to get reelected, and they listen to what's important. Now, we never tell our employees what to do. We don't tell them how to vote. We don't tell them which issues to support. But we do tell them, support what you believe in. Know the facts. Know the issues. And be involved. Be involved by writing your congressman, sending an email, making a phone call. And I can tell you how effective it is. We recently had an issue that truly threatened the steel industry, and we made all of our employees aware of it. Again, I want to stress, we don't tell them to write a letter. We don't tell them to send an email. We don't tell them to send a fax. But we make sure that they are aware of the facts and make their own decision on what to do. On this particular issue, okay, we sent out an email informing everyone what was going on, giving them all sides of the issue, asking them to sit down, think about this issue, and get involved on this issue. The next morning, we got a call from just about every local politician in every community where our mills were located saying, hey guys, I can't keep paper in my fax machine. I can't even open my emails anymore. My point is this, you can have an impact with your teams. Support organizations, that's fine. Get into action groups, that's fine. But encourage your teammates, all of your teammates, to be involved. That goes a long way in making a change. You know, at Nucor, Nucor is spelled N-U-C-O-R, and I'm often asked, what does Nucor stand for? And I respond, it's nephews, uncles, cousins, and other relatives. Okay? <laughs> because we're located in very small communities, so our company truly is a corporate family. And whenever I say that, I say when we have these issues and you want to make an impact with a local politician, remember what Nucor stands for. And don't just contact him yourself. Get your nephew, nephew, your uncle, your cousin, and your other relatives to contact them also. You'd be amazed at how many people you can muster on an issue. Do it, be active. Understand the issues and make sure the politicians at every level know where you stand on those issues.